Welcome along to the Red City for the fifth round of the ABB FIA Formula E Championship, the Marrakesh e -Prix. It's race day, finally. Just arrived at the track, amazing atmosphere, super excited. Let's go for it. Hey everyone, it's race day here at Marrakesh. We've got lots to crack on with, so I'll catch up with you later on. We are just about set for qualifying ahead of the 2020 Marrakesh e Prix. Nevins have opted to go out, just turn it up, full power, away we go. There comes Evans, where is he going to come out with regards to everyone else? I think Mitch Evans is too late. Watch the red lights. Oh, and they he, cross at uh, exactly the yes. same time. The championship leader will start at the back of the grid. It was a genuine miscalculation from our side. It's obviously hard to take. You know, I, I thought I crossed the line and then it went red, but according to official timing, we were two tenths too late. So, um, huge, huge shame. James Collado, who now has all of Jaguar's hopes for qualifying, resting on him. First season in Formula E. This is good stuff from Collado. Across the line, eighth place. Not too bad. Not bad at all. Considering the, the tough qualities we've had at the start of the season, it's a massive improvement. Obviously, top 10 was my target. The goal is top five for the race. Uh, fingers crossed, it's a clean one, and uh, we'll do our best. So here we are from, unfortunately, the back of the grid and saying we're to take on the chin and pay the price for. But yeah, full focus now, obviously trying to produce a good race. So I'll be doing all I can to um, obviously go forward and, and try and finish somewhere in the points. Nice to be a little bit more in the front of the grid, qualifying isn't everything. It's about being efficient, good in the race, getting a clean start and seeing how we go. But yeah, let's go for the points. Top five would be, would be an awesome focus. The championship leader, Mitch Evans, is here at the back of the grid. All five lights are on. We go green in Marrakesh. Three wide. James Collado around the outside in the Jaguar has got up into eighth position, having started in 10th in that Jaguar. As you see Collado defending from John Eric Verne, but nothing doing. John Eric Verne makes the move into turn one. Prince is slower than you. Good job. These guys just keep screwing themselves by lifting so late to try and get me behind. Position? 16 now, 16. We're looking very strong. 0.05. Roland is having trouble with energy and struggling aggressively with him. You'll get them in no time. Let's smoke through them. Evans carving his way up the order and he's just got past Oliver Roland up into eighth place. Mitch Evans got the fastest lap of the race as well. I was P6 on the line from P24. Good job, mate. Very good job. I mean, Mitch Evans' drive was mighty. I'm not sure what went wrong. Really, no pace at all. Uh, just went backwards, so we need to try and uh, see what the issue is going forward. A massive 45 minutes we just put out. Managed to crawl in 18 places to finish P6. Yeah, I will take that with open hands. Just a huge thanks to the team for giving me the right plan in the race. We executed it to perfection and passed a lot of cars along the way.